Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to Dragon Age Inquisition. We are back here in Empress of Leon. We are traveling up the road here to Sullivan Keep, which we are hoping to be able to retake. Fingers crossed. Um, I don't know what we're going to find there, but I imagine a shit ton of Red Templars is probably not too far off the mark. Uh, oh, there is... Oh, God, there is a one... There's one man trying to attack Sullivan Keep. And... Presently, he's not doing the best job. And saying that, neither am I. So, yeah, no... Do you know what? I must admit, that was uh, that was very poor on my part. Oh, it's Michelle! Ah, it's not just any man. It's uh, it's Michelle. Good old Michelle. Can I speak to Michelle? Bad news, Harald. Your efforts to drive off the Red Templars have not gone unnoticed. Imshale knows we're here. He sent Red Templars after me. And a pack of shades descends now upon Sarnia. The people are defenseless. I must return without delay. It's up to you to destroy Imshale. A pack of shades is now is, is now descending on Sarnia. Well, that isn't isn't that just delightful, right? Okay. I guess we gotta we gotta go and kill Imshale then. I must admit, he seemed very. Very, um, very hell bent on on being the being being involved in killing him, Shale. And now he's happy to take a back seat in the in the matter. I mean, yes, obviously, it it his hand has kind of been forced by an attack on his town, but still, it's a bit weird, isn't it? You, you think? There we go, go. Where the hell did that other guy die? I really don't know now, you know. Oh, oh, it's Rashvine. Uh, I thought I was missing a corpse, but instead, no, it's just some hanging Rashvine. Lovely. Lovely fucking jubbly. Right, okay, that the enemies are up there on the walls, I believe. So it's just deactivate myself for now, I don't wanna waste it. Stealth uh, stealth is great on this game. It it it, it, it works exceptionally well. Just need to recharge so I can go and get the jump on these guys up here too. There we are. So if I creep up behind this guy. There we are. Well, we well and truly ganked them there. Properly ganked them. Right, what's this thing to read? Test notes. We must carefully control Exposure's red lyrium. The last one entered a savage frenzy from the lyrium. We had to put it down. Uh, once the red lyrium takes hold, their strength increases as we expected, but it makes them even more difficult to leash. Until we obtain the creatures in large enough numbers to test different techniques, we will never achieve a reliable method of corruption and control. I may have to recommend setting aside the entire experiment. Surely the behemoth serves our purposes. Uh, we've seen enough behemoths. Already, I don't want. I don't want any more to deal with. Thank you. The giant brought from the Emerald Graves last week died this morning. It had received a small injury to the abdomen that eventually killed it. We have only one surviving giant. Fortunately, the first changes have been promising. I am hopeful. 
It must be difficult to capture the creatures without violence, but there is too much at risk in beating them into, into submission. Breeding them might be feasible. Unfortunately, no one has spotted a female of the species. Breeding giants. Fucking hell. We are going to try to do something about it. Whether we can or not is a different matter. So this is so this is a dead a dead red lyrium infused giant. Can you just stop experimenting with red lyrium? Please. It's not good it's not good. It's not a good thing to tie around with at all. Please stop. Love Craig. Thank you. Well, Craig is to be to, to be precise. Oh, hey, Morphalandaris, nice. I sure I I'm pretty sure we only need we only only need one lot of Falandaris to complete the quest back in the hinterlands, but never hurts to have a bit more, does it? Oh, there is a giant over there. Uh okay. Right, that is awkward. I think the giant is now heading this way. Lovely. Lovely jubbly. He's an infected giant. I think he will actually go down fairly easily though, which is uh, a blessing. I say that as he almost kills me. There we go. We got him. We got him. In Templar Shield Man is not messing around in the slightest. Got him? Got him. Treacherous right. ground here. I'm picturing myself bumping all the way down a mountain. Uh why? Right. So I try not to picture that. Uh if you if you just if you just try and block block that image you just had there out of your mind entirely. And everything will be fine. Because the more that you picture that, the more that it's probably going to happen. And it, I must admit, the this this area that we're in now isn't very mountainous. There's no steep edges to fall off or anything like that. It's just it's just a lot of like slight hills. Like there's there's nothing really to write home about in terms of crazy. Um, Earth or anything like that. It's it's very, it's very normal. And yet Dorian is still shit scared of everything. Dorian is shit scared of the world. Right. Um. Just loads more Arbor blessing here, isn't there? Yeah. Tons more. I can hear some slightly funny noises coming from uh, the distance. I mean, I mean that could be anything, but I'm not going to assume it's friendly because I feel like I'll probably end up being in quite an in for nasty, quite na quite a nasty surprise uh, by the end of this. Still haven't found any of those crawlback spines either. So we shall have to keep an eye out. I just don't think that my Eyes out are um, working too well so far. Where is this secret? It's not. It's on the end of this bridge, is it? I really. Oh my god! You know what I actually think it is? I actually generally think someone. Someone has put this. Pulsating ring item on the end of uh, that bridge there, just to be an absolute pain in the ass. And you know what? Well done. You succeeded in being a massive pain in the ass. 
actually not sure how we get how to get up there either. Yeah, this could actually be a little bit awkward, you know. As far as I know. Okay, right now we're talking. Here we go. Ah, it's just mob balls. Abyssal peach, not so much filtered as dredged. Should be kept in a cold, dark place. Also locked, forgotten as well, if one is wise. One, one never forgets about the peach. Never. One cannot forget about the peach. Alright, let's take this eyeball blessing. Let's go and kick some more Templar ass. Just up the hill here. I gotta say that there's only two guards, but the, there is more behind them, so... I don't know whether, whether they knew we were coming and they've somehow managed to strategize for a fight, but... I mean, I'm not gonna lie, that, that if if they... Oh, hello. I have accidentally opened the console. I do not want to open the console. Please close the console. Thank you. I... I promise, I promise I am not a cheater. You can even look at the console history. Right, so he's down to a knee now. Okay, that is another giant down. Oh, oh, we are still getting peppered with arrows, are we? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. From all the way over here as well. Right, let's get some looty loot off the uh, giant. Okay, uh, so yeah, we'll press on through to Sword and Keep. Don't know what more they're going to throw at us. They've already thrown two sort of infected giants, which were sturdy, but not a massive test. I don't, I just don't know if they ever got to creating anything that a little bit more powerful than um, a giant or something like that, maybe. I really don't know as of yet. I'm sure we'll, she'll find out soon, though. No doubt in my mind at all. No doubt in my mind that 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 that, that we will find out soon. Oh, hello, 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 hello. Not getting bullied by bullied by that guy. Or any red templar for that matter. Okay, dokie. So how so how close are we now? We are fairly close to the actual keep itself now. Shouldn't be too much longer before we get somewhere with that. Not going back for that, I don't think. Okay, so Lord and Keep, what else what else are you are, are you going to throw at us today? Round shield and a lightning staff. Cool, cool, cool. What else we got? Anything? There's not actually a massive amount up here. 
I did think it was a D tier, and then I, and then I saw I saw the enemies, and I was like, oh, I'm actually going the right way here. But to be fair, I've not really found anything that would suggest that I am. Uh, back this way, I think. Yeah, I, I, th I think I just need to follow sort of inside, I think, rather than taking turns. Or do I? Oh, do I? Yeah, this this is when it becomes a little bit more problematic, and I can't find the way, the easy way in. Again, mainly just me more than anything else, but it's not exactly positive. This. Right. Okay. Yeah. Let's try and retrace our steps. As we came this way. I think we went this way to try and combat the arches of the enemies when we first came up here. And then we got to, the, got to this little camp. Here. So, like, theoretically, it should be high up somewhere. Still didn't keep documents. We arrived in the Highlands at night. I was immediately given the task of overseeing the acquisition and staffing of the Sarnia Quarry. I asked the general why we needed a quarry, if the crystals will grow anywhere. Apparently the Elder One believes that the composition of the earth here will ensure that it grows more rapidly and abundantly. I didn't ask why he believes it. The general doesn't like questions. He probably doesn't know. Some of my men feel we should take the quarry by force. The general did not specify how, how I was to secure the land, so I'm considering a more subtle approach. Any suspicions we raise will increase the chance of a military investigation, perhaps even the, new, the newly formed Inquisition. We must operate in secret as long as possible. I scouted the quarry yesterday. It is quiet with the with the wall raging. I expect the man for luxury granite has decreased significantly. A thought occurs to me: what so much is gained through commerce? Why not exploit that? And that's when he decided to become a helicopter pilot. Happy days. Can I actually speak to the Holland bosses? Where have they gone? Where have they gone? No idea what happened to well everybody there basically. That was um That was a little bit rough. A little bit rough. And yeah, like I said, I don't think I actually can get to this side to get Power Fantasy whacked on oh, unless Is that staircase? That's that's staircase. Staircase have not been that's not a staircase, that that is a brick wall. From the angle that I was at, it looked like a staircase, and in fact it wasn't, it was a brick wall. Ah, just like I seem to have hit a brick, a brick wall right about now. Uh, right, let's try and get, let's try and get above them. Yeah, this is where... Oh, hang on, we can actually open a building. Is that another door we can open? Yes, it is. I think, we're, I think we are moving in the right direction. I think, yes we are. There are definitely Templars here to kill, so I shall kill them. I mean, we—I mean, we just been absolutely peppered, but fuck now, Dorian. If you would, thank you very much. I just trying to loot it. Oh no! I tried to revive myself, and, and then, and then in the process, actually, actually ended up looting my own body. That—that that almost takes skill, by this almost. So Dorian is almost now bashed as well, so we will use Cassandra to get him back on his feet. Boom. Relirium. 
I'm surprised, surprised you don't get any objectives completed for killing the actual Red Templars inside rather than just what's around them. Uh, okay. I owe you an apology. Apologize to me? For what? For judging your seekers. Considering my feelings on Tevinza, I shouldn't throw stones. That is remarkably decent of you, Dorian. It was fun to go to you. You get this little knot between your eyebrows. <laughs> there it is. Delightful. <laughs> Continue on this path and we'll see if it remains such. Let's not get too feisty, guys. Come on, we are on the same side here. Right, on that note, guys, I think we are going to end this, end this episode here. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have them, please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I shall catch you all in the next episode of Dragon Age Inquisition. Thanks again, guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye.